I'm gonna be so honest right now. I didn't even think that I would make a video about Redonda Vault simply because I just feel like it's not my place to share my feelings or the facts of the case, the trial, whatever. I just don't feel as though it's my place simply because I'm not a nurse, one, nor do I work with medicine directly, touch medicine or handle medicine. So my opinion uh, doesn't really matter because I don't have experience around that. However, something happened to me today because of that case. I got an 86 on my exam today. And after I saw my exam grade, I closed my computer and I froze. I didn't feel happy. I didn't jump for joy. I wasn't excited. I wasn't like, oh yeah, bitch, we about to be registered nurses. I didn't feel that. I didn't feel that. What I felt was fear because that 86 just reminded me that I'm one step closer to one day being out there in the field. And unfortunately, as selfish as this may sound and as horrible as this may sound, this Redonda Vault case might be the one and only learning opportunity that future nurses have, that current nurses have. I'm scared. I'm discouraged. I I don't even know what this means for me as a future nurse, what it means for current nurses right now. Where does the culture of nursing turn to? But I had to remind myself of my why. Why did I start nursing school? Why did I apply? Why do I stay up late studying? Why do I force myself to understand the rationale of meds, of proper dosage calculations? Why do I stay up late doing these things? It's because I want to be a competent and competent nurse that practices ethically. And it makes me think about all the times that Redonda Vault stayed up late studying for her exams, how many times she wanted to give up. And not one moment in her nursing school journey did she ever think that she would be the nurse that would kill a patient because none of us think that it will be us, but it can be. Why? Because mistakes happen. And this guilty verdict has now conditioned me as a nursing student that despite me getting an 86 on my exam, when I get on that floor, I'm expected to not make any mistake. What does this mean for my future? If you're a nursing student right now, please don't give up. As scary as this shit is, you got to remember why you applied, why you sacrificed all them late night studying. Don't give up.